I'm here at a conference in Turkey where I'm about to be converted into a hologram. I'm just going to take you through a little bit of the technology. Here we are in the process of setting up, and uh, I'll just show you where we are. This is an absolutely huge stage, as you can see, with two video screens on one side and on the other. And uh, we've got my slides in the middle. And here we have a hologram, or at least this is where we were, I'll appear tomorrow, and uh, also having a conversation with myself standing on the stage. One of us will be in the past, and the other will be in the future. And this is all for a cloud event for TEB, which is uh, one of the banks in Turkey. So here we are, we're in the process of recording the hologram and to do that we're going to use green screen technology. What's that? It's a room which is entirely lined with green material. In fact it's got green walls, green ceiling and no shadows. It's got huge amounts of studio lights and it's just like the studio that is used for uh, things like uh, the weather forecasts on TV. And when you process it, it means that whatever is behind me that is green disappears. And I better not get any green in my glasses, because if my glasses get a bit of green reflection on them, then my glasses turn transparent, and the whole picture, my, my bits of my face will, will become transparent. Because when this is processed, you will only see a background, and the background will be completely blank. And that's what we need to create the hologram for tomorrow's show. And here are some of the technicians here, we've been working all day on this. <laughs> now what we're going to do next is to take a journey through the future. We're now going to look at the next five years of the future from 2015 to 2020. So, do I understand from this that biofuels are dead as a fuel by 2015?